Hi, my name is Trudy Ludwig. And I'm Patrice Martin. And we're collaborating on a new story together called Brave Every Day. The number one issue that seems to keep cropping up that is shared with me by administrators and school counselors and teachers is the amount of anxiety has skyrocketed among children, even children in kindergarten. There are picture books that are out there that deal with anxiety, but I wanted to approach it from a different angle. I wanted to reframe the issue of anxiety to show kids that kids who experience anxiety are a lot braver than they think they are. In fact, they're very brave because they have to go beyond their comfort zone every single day. So this is one of the first pages of the book, and it's also one of my favorite lines from the book from Trudy, where she talks about most kids like to play hide and seek, but not Camilla, she just likes to hide. So the inspiration for this came from uh, my love of laundry lines and clean laundry and uh, Camilla hiding. So I thought, well, where would she hide and hide and seek? Well, why not in a nice fresh towel wrapped up snugly with her little companion be beside her by her feet there. These are places that uh, I used to hide when I was a child. I, I know most kids like to play with cardboard boxes, but they were also nice little safe compartments if you're hiding. And then like in the closet, little I know lots of kids have tucked into cupboards, reading books or playing with pots and pans or just a nice snug place to be. And then nowadays everybody wears hoodies and I see lots of kids with that little hood pulled really tight like they just want to be uh, in a cocoon there to be safe. And what I loved about this is showing the hiding is when I was doing research for the story, I found out that there is a term for kids that suffer from social anxiety. It's called children in hiding. And this last page is how I wanted to convey Camilla's anxiety. So my inspiration came from the field trip to the aquarium that the class was going to take. Uh, know that when I'm anxious, it starts off as sort of a bubbling feeling. And then finally, it just all encompasses me and, and I'm like totally submerged. And I thought, well, that's what the sea creatures are in water. They're totally submerged. So I use the hues of the water and then all the swirls and the bubbles to sort of surround and encompass Camilla here to convey her anxieties. And thank you so much for listening. Goodbye.